So a quick video to show you the uh, servo system working with a DC motor that was pulled out of a fax machine and it is uh, amazingly strong. I don't have any specs on this motor. There's no part number or anything. It was just found in a in a fax machine. We pulled it out and hooked it up. And you can see that I can't stop it. <sighs> Quite strong. Um, just to give a quick rundown on everything here, this is the GRBL shield running GRBL on a Arduino Uno. So depending on where you buy it, that's not a lot of money. And then here is the Bob Pid servo controller. So this guy is sending step and direction pulses over here, telling it where it wants the motor to be. Here is our position encoder, which is just a magnet. There's the magnet on the shaft, on the back shaft of the motor. You can see that little guy there. Not perfectly aligned, but uh, it's pretty secure. It hasn't come off yet. <laughs> Probably won't. It's boxy down there. And that's just positioned over the encoder chip in there. You can see the little LED flashing indicating, uh, that, you know, it's detecting the turning of the motor. And then that sends signals through these wires back to the bob pit again, telling it where um, the motor actually is. So we're getting where it should be, where it actually is. And then this wire right here, coming out of the other jack on the bob pit, is going over to our uh, not quite one horsepower, almost one horsepower DC motor driver right here, which is running off of a, what is this? 24 volt? 24 volt supply. Um, uh, and uh, that then is sending out the actual power to the motor right here. And the motor's slightly warm. I know that when we run it for a good long time, it actually starts to get uh, quite warm. And of course, uh, I should mention that the GRBL here is just getting standard G code from um, Universal G Code Sender uh, on my PC. No point in showing that. But I just thought it was kind of cool to show you how, you know, a very, very, very cheap setup can provide, you know, quite strong and very accurate um, positioning of the motor here. Uh, Bob Pid is $15. The DC motor driver is $10. This is 10 bucks. That is an amazing price, considering that it's almost a horsepower and that it actually works. I mean, it's you'll see all kinds of stuff available from China on Ali, whatever, that is, you know, advertising 30 amps, 60 amps. You can't run 30 amps through a printed circuit board. It will fry it. it just isn't possible. Um, at least not through the printed circuit boards that, that, that they're showing. So, um, yeah, just crazy. And then this guy is 15 bucks, the encoder. So we've got $30, $40 worth of electronics, plus your motion controller here, uh, whatever you get your GRBL and your Arduino Uno for. Uh, and you would just need to replicate this part, right? Um three times and you could have an absolutely massive 3D printer or a CNC machine or a router or whatever you wanted to use it with. I guess probably the GRBL is more suited to uh, CNC machines and routers and things like that. So there you go. Thanks for watching.